lovelies welcome or welcome back to my channel I have this is my first reading vlog and I'm so excited you guys I'm reading talking about the Boys of Tommen series Taming 7 the fifth book sorry I'm trying to do something as I'm talking <laughs> the fifth book to the Boys of Tommen series by Chloe Walsh and oh my gosh so good I do want to shout out to Madison Fox. You are my inspiration for doing this reading vlog. I love, 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 love your videos if you see this. Hi. Um, anyways, we follow... Uh, la, 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 la. I was thinking. Sorry. Let's start over. Let's do this. Ready? Okay. Cool. We follow Gibsy and Claire. Gibsy is... Claire's best friend. Um, they're best friends. And basically, he does not... He wants a relationship with her. And she wants one with him. But he is nervous that, that the, the, if they have a relationship, it will ruin the friendship and everything will go to poop. Um, and so they end up... Just being friends, you know, pushing their feelings to the side for a bit. But as you read on, there are, they get, it gets, they realize that their feelings, they, their feelings are a lot more. And so they try to, they, um, they end up in a, they end up getting closer, you know, not that they weren't already close, but, um, so, yeah, you start off, they're like, they're pushing their feelings aside. They're trying to not admit that they have feelings, which they're just, they're all like, no, I don't want to be with her. Or, yes, I want to be with her, but I don't want to ruin said friendship because it will break her and I don't want to break her heart. So, you go through Gibsy's, you know, inner turmoil. And I will say this book, I don't know if I already said it, but let me just disclaimer. This book does have trigger warnings. I would check trigger warnings. It has self-harm, it has rape, and it has suicidal ideation. It just goes hand-in-hand hand with self-harm, I think. I don't think. I mean... Anyways, I would check the trigger warnings just in case I missed anything. Just a heads up. And I will have... I say... Have tissues for this book. For sure have tissues for this book. Because it is a emotional roller coaster. Um, anyways, there... So once they finally get, the, they realize they can't hold off their feelings and they finally get into a relationship. And oh my gosh, it is so cool, like so good once they figure out that they actually like each other and their feelings are like, they realize that it's like they actually like each other and they can feel what they feel and not, you know, combust and hurt the other one. It's so cute because there's this one scene, I don't, I don't know. I know I said spoiler free. This isn't really a spoiler. Um, so I'm just going to go out and say it. There's this one scene where they're kissing in the rain. And you guys, it's so cute. It's so adorable. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. And I just, it's so cute. It's, it's so cute. Um, and so that's just the most adorable thing ever. Um, this book was just, I gave it a five stars because it was that good. Now, there was part in, I have some part in the book where I didn't think I was going to finish it. Like, I thought I wasn't going to finish it, but I pushed through and I read it and I'm so glad I did because it was so worth the read. It's so good. Um, and like, so good. I was, oh my gosh, it's just, there's so, times you want to cry and sometimes you just want to laugh. And then types you want to cry again. And so I just, yeah, I loved it 100%. I will say, and I don't think this is a spoiler, but, and if I do have spoilers, I'm going to do it towards the end of this. I'll even leave a timestamp of the spoiler versus, versus spoiler free. So if you want spoilers, you can go ahead and spoil yourself all you want. But do know this is the fifth book, so you might want to read the other books before you check the spoiler on this. Because if I spoil it, it's going to be for this book. So you might want to avoid the spoiler until you read the other books. So you don't like be like, oh my gosh, I spoiled it for myself. 
don't get mad at me because I did tell you. Don't go. Don't spoil it. Okay? Cool. So anyways, um, such a good book. And I loved it. Five star read for me. Chloe Walsh, you are amazing. I love you so, so, so much. Um, and yeah, it's just so good, you guys. I definitely think you should pick up Boys of Tommen. If you love, like, friends to lovers and, like, banter and, like, the cutest shit, I mean, the cutest stuff ever, then yeah, go for it. I mean, yeah, why not? Um, I will, like I said, there are triggers to be warned for that. Um, but yeah, so good. Now, the time I've been waiting for, and I'm sure some of you have been waiting for, the spoilers. Let's go into the spoilers. Let's do this. Okay. So, this is the spoiler section. I'm going to spoil it. But I'm also not going to give you all the details where I just told you the whole book. Anywho, um, how do I, okay. I'm trying to think of how I'm going to tell you guys without spoiling the whole book and I just basically told you all the book. Okay, so we start off, it's like, it's emotional. So when you get to about right um, here. Or maybe a look, maybe it was like right here, somewhere like towards the end. There is something that happens. I'm not going to say because I, even though it's a spoiler, I do not want to give away the plot. Um, but anyways, I'll say it like this: There's the friendship named Li the girl named Lizzie. She is Gibsy's nemesis. I want to say like frenemy. I don't really know what to call them because they were friends at once, but they're enemies now. So frenemies maybe, but she is friends with he. She is friends with, um, not Gypsy. My gosh, Claire. So they are best friends. So something happens to Lizzie's sister. Okay, something so bad, like something bad, so bad that she hates Gypsy for it. Well, um, you see them fight throughout the whole book. She obviously has. A stick up her butt, you know, and I got where she was coming from, and then boom, you find out this whole, you find out something that you were not expecting. Like, I was shooketh. Shook, shook, if. <laughs> I don't know if I just made that word up. Anyways, you find out that what happened to her sister actually happened to someone else in the book. Main character. That's all I'm going to say. Because I know this is a spoiler, but I want you to find out for yourself. Because it's such a good book. Um, anyways, yes. That happens. And you're like, oh my gosh. Did that really just happen? You're like, yes, that really just happened. You're going to need tissues throughout that whole rest of the book. You're going to need tissues. Lay on the tissues. Like, layers and layers of tissues. Because it's, it's like, it's emotional. And you, it's like you feel for him because he has a mental breakdown at one point and you're just, oh my gosh, I'm emotionally emotional just thinking about it. You feel for him because he's going through it. And so you just see him having a breakdown and you really feel for him and you just, you get all emotional and it's just, it's, it's a roller coaster. I gave this book five stars. I highly recommend picking it up. So, yes, that is my reading vlog. I don't know if I did good, but we're going to go for it. Anyways, um, if you want me to do a reading vlog for the other books, let me know um, in the comment section. Also, please like and subscribe and leave a comment if you can for this channel if you loved my content. Also, if you want a book tour, because I have a lot of books, let me know and I will do a book tour. Um, but yeah, that is the review or yeah, book vlog review, whatever you want to call it for Taming 7. Bye lovelies. See you later. Mwah.